Good morning, day one for Yellowstone. I'm excited. I have warm clothes over there. I have candy from the reception, ready to see geysers and water springing out of nowhere. Ready? Let's go. Making one of two. Oops, I pressed two. It's making random pancakes for us. Fancy. Wait. It's like Uber Eats. I feel like I can go do other things and then come back for it. It's smelling really good. Wow. Whoa. Got a pancake. Now they have to make a second one because I ordered two. There we have it. Have two pancakes. A few moments later. West Yellowstone, Montana looking gorgeous this morning. Lots of bears everywhere. Those are the chargers. And it's every seven days, which is perfect. This payment is better than how it is in Kenya where they charge you that amount per day and then you have to pay that every day they need to do that in Kenya Candy! because we need energy first of all look at this view pines, pines, pines gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous back to serious things they charge $35 for 7 days for just the car they don't charge individuals why do we overcharge people in Kenya okay maybe because we have the big five and the super dots <laughs> but yeah let us go to Yellowstone if you walk here I know you can't but if you walk it's free but all the best thing alive <laughs> we are driving towards all faithful there's a thing on the internet that tells you when that geyser will go off it now says it will go off at noon it is currently 11.02 and google maps says says we are 30 minutes away so we will be lucky to see all faithful the reason they call it all faithful is because it is faithful with its eruptions it always goes off and I think it always goes off at around the same time every day. Hence why it is all faithful. Animal, is that a bison? Wow. Let's go to all faithful, we'll see more of them. Look at all those hot springs. They're everywhere. But we're running to Old Faithful and then we'll pay attention to the rest of this later. And look at that, gorgeous. close them or we're gonna come back to them let's go to Old Faithful we are chasing Old Faithful it's currently 1124 <laughs> oh it is misty wow has waterfalls looks beautiful look at that people gorgeous
parking nice they have a filling station and a general store many other things because people I was gonna say because people come and stay here for seven days without leaving so this becomes like home yeah it's cold so I'm warmed up and it's my train so I have a rainy jacket on top of the warm jacket inside it's winter in Montana it has begun because we're in the mountains they have a sign with time wow let's go oh nice warm you can even see it from inside without feeling cold There is a museum over here with a lot of information. For example, when you touch here, you can get to see a few things. A touch to begin. There you go. For example, you can do grand and see how it erupts. And then you can compare that feature with something else watch video watch video see two things erupted at the same time which video erupts higher this one is not erupting but anyway <laughs> main menu <laughs> ah. main menu the thing is broken I think I broke it let me run away before they notice. <laughs> now we wait. This is as much people as we find here. That one is giving us a show. Okay. This one is trying. Sit down and wait. Yeah. 
Stop making these little babies, right? <laughs> <laughs> We're ready for this now. Come on, little child. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, Wow. What a thousand miles of travel. <laughs> it was. <coughs> nice. It's much longer than it was. Okay, and that one also was pretty long. Uh, this is as much people who are here that around and I would say it was worth it. It is actually a good surfing. <laughs> Blue star spring. Yeah don't do that. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Wow. Look at that. Guys, I'm freezing to get you this content. You better subscribe. You better subscribe. How's my water come up? Let's go look for more. Of this beautiful tiny springs. Let's go. Another beautiful one. Any waterfall. Okay, let's continue hunting more tiny ones. Oh, look at that tiny one. That oh, one, cute. Look at the hot spring. It's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, look, changes color a little bit. Mm, it is too foggy to see. But wow. Oh, there's another one there. There's another one everywhere. unceremonial but it's beautiful still I was just walking and I saw a bison eating what a wow just walking oh look it's bluish I don't know why you can't really see because it's cold yeah it's colorful right now because of the fog and the mist it's hard to see the colors but it's still very beautiful if you ask me even the mist or the fog or whatever they call it has different colors it's called the grand prismatic spring gorgeous this should be hot don't walk there this is how it's supposed to look all we get today okay So, I guess we've seen a few springs. I don't know. I don't know if you're seeing any more. We'll see. We'll see. If not, should we have tea with those ones that we've seen? Ha. <laughs> Look, another tiny one. And this one is not steamy, so we will appreciate the colors. Let's get closer. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. 
not so sure I'm seeing any turquoiseness in this one. Yo, comment down below if you see it as turquoise. But uh, I might be colorblind. <laughs> oh, look at that fluctuation of human beings. Oh, not too visible. Very foggy. Can you hear the sounds? Sounds really painful. If you get in there, it is called fountain paint pots. Interesting. Wow. Can you hear that? Yo. Another one. Wow. Crazy. Leather pool. Just on the road. That is that. This is one that you don't really need to book or look and plan because it's always going off. Getting there shortly. <laughs> there. See? Do you have another name? We'll find out soon. It's called the Fountain Gazer. It's written over there. See? It's going off. Just erupting. Yep. Nice. See? Oh, yeah, sorry, I said fountain, but I was confused. It is called Fuzzing Geyser. Nice. It is new. And now it's sunny. Yay, the sun is coming out. Look at my sunglasses. Anyway, one last stop, the lake, and then back to the hotel. Can't wait, I'm tired now, I'm tired of driving and being in the cold. And having a cold, oh yeah, I have a cold. Mm, yeah. Oh yeah, last one. We are here to see the Yellowstone Lake, which is over there. And then off we go to, what was that hotel called? Clubhouse Inn. Oh, look, tamp paint pots. And they're not steaming. It's actually a very beautiful picture. Can you see? Gorgeous. The lake is the one behind this thingy. Thin crust area. Stay on the boat. Oh, look. Really beautiful. Like the color contrasts. Dark blue, light blue, green. Can you see? Not just pine trees. There's something here called the blue bell pool. And it is teeming. It's beautiful. Wow. Oh, look at that blue. It's the contrast of colors for me. What is that body? Oh, it's not a body, it's a squirrel. Oh, and that's the lake. Beautiful. Look at that beautiful lake and mountains. Lake and mountains. Oh, and that is the show that is erupting over there we'll see it we are going there i'll take it there people don't panic oh look many tiny little hot springs everywhere yeah one day you will become as big as that one when you grow up <laughs> an exploded bay in winter holds 
Aww. Otters come and swim in the winter. Cute. That is the big lake, people. It's at West Thump, Yellowstone. But they'll give you a map, you'll be fine. You'll see all of them. Lake Shore Geyser. Lake Shore Geysers. That's the lake. Those are the lake shoots. They also keep going off. One last look. It's beautiful. Okay. Yellowstone is beautiful. Yeah. I wonder what it's called. It's not active right now though. And it's the fact that they form themselves. You know? Fishing corn. The water is beautiful. Cold or hot? It's cold. Interesting. Big corn. Yeah, I'm a happy girl. I can go back home. I'm happy. Are you happy? That is very beautiful. I would want to come and swim in there. Like I see why people get in trouble. Beautiful. Thank you. Wow. Oh, this is beautiful. Decided to walk back to the continental divide. Do you know what that means? Let me tell you. It means I'm scared of the road. <laughs> there is an invisible line that divides the west and the east side of America, hence continental divide. Look at that. And that is the end of day one at Yellowstone. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like, share, subscribe. I will see you next weekend. Which is day two for me. But next weekend for you.